One of my favorite things in life is social media atheists. Militant atheists. I don't care if you don't believe in God, that's your problem. But militant ones, ones who are like angry because other people believe in God and they have to like tell you how angry they are. And it's just super tiresome. But uh, there, there, there's this, there's this like hatred for religion out there among the left. They, ju they just despise it. And the reason they despise it is, of course, if you're worshiping God, you're not worshiping government. And by government, they mean their elite, because they assume government is their elite, because they believe that they have some sort of right to rule. So it's really uh, heresy to actually worship God instead of government, which that is them. And Chris Pratt did it, and he, and he blew minds. I mean, to, to tell them, to tell a giant group of cultural liberals, no, I don't worship you. I don't worship government. I don't worship a government composed of people like you ruling over people like me. It's blasphemy to them. They, they just, they, they can't tolerate it. They get angry. And that's what rebellion is. That's a real rebel. That's a guy with a cause. That's a guy with a clue. That's a guy who's actually taking a risk. Because you know there are people now who are going to be going, well, you know, Chris Pratt's super popular actor, but also decent human being. Mm, I'm not sure. You know, we got to weigh those against each other. We don't want to take the chance. People are not going to want, there are certain people who are not going to want to work with him uh, because he has confessed uh, to, to possessing some form of religious faith. It's going to freak them out. But he did anyway. He just doesn't care. That's real rebellion. And that's going on more and more. And you can do it in your daily life. We don't have to kneel down to these false idols of leftism. We don't have to pray to the elite. We owe them nothing. We don't owe them reverence. We don't owe them respect. The purpose of the elite, and, and, and in society, there, there is a purpose for an elite, an elite who, who comes and, and, and you know, manages the institutions of society while the rest of normal people go out and you know, work and be with their families and everything. There is a purpose for an elite, but the, the purpose of the elite is, is not to be served, it is to serve. Yeah, you get some privileges in the elite, but at the end of the day, your duty is to normal people. Your duty is to serve. Our elite doesn't understand that. Our elite thinks their duty doesn't exist.